This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm John Madden with 3 News Now and here's a look at what's happening now. A string of robberies takes place in a span of 45 minutes in Omaha Sunday night. The first happening at Come and Go off North 72nd Street and Family Dollar off of Radio Highway, then Tobacco Road off of Saddle Creek Road and Bucky's off of Center Street. The Omaha Police Department believes all four are connected. They also say shots were fired at Bucky's, but no one was injured during that incident or at the other locations. Police have issued a watch on all convenience stores in Omaha as they continue to search for a suspect. And kids got a chance to get up close to lots of cool police gear on Sunday and get some trick-or-treating done at the same time. The Douglas County Sheriff's Office held its first trunk or treat event at the Douglas County Law Enforcement Center. Other law enforcement agencies joined in on the fun, showing off everything from police cruisers and helicopters to fire trucks. And I'm 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update. Cold start to Monday morning, temperatures in the upper 20s and low 30s for most of us. So partly cloudy skies, but then more clouds continue moving back in throughout the day on Monday. Coming in with those clouds, some more moisture. So between about 3 and 4 o'clock in the afternoon, we start to see some light rain across the area. That eventually switches over to some a bit of a wintry mix and some light snow between about 6 and 7 o'clock in the evening. Then light snow continues on and off up until about 11 o'clock midnight. Moves out of here pretty quickly though, so we're not expecting a whole lot as far as accumulation goes. In fact, most of us will end up with less than an inch. A few areas farther down to the south near Falls City, Clarinda could be closer to one, one and a half, possibly even two inches in a few isolated spots, but it is going to be harder to get some of those higher accumulations in general, just because we're going to have to get over those warmer ground temperatures. So a lot of this is going to be melting very quickly as it falls. 39 though, the high for Omaha today on Monday afternoon, north winds around 10 to 15 miles per hour. It stays cold pretty much all week long. By Monday and Tuesday, our highs only make it back closer to 40 degrees. Getting into Wednesday, a little bit cooler, mid 30s. That continues into Thursday with another round of some snow showers moving in Wednesday into Thursday. Still a little early to pinpoint any totals with that next system coming in, but keep that in mind for any uh, trick or treating you're going to be doing on Halloween. It's definitely going to be cold, so find a way to incorporate those coats with those costumes. We get to Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. We slowly start to warm things back up into the mid 40s, near 50 degrees by next weekend. Want something spicy? Sliced jalapeno peppers, cream cheese, beef, bacon, and real cheddar and mozzarella cheese. It's my jalapeno papa pie. Add a one-topping pizza and cinnamon monkey bread for a real feast. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.